Under the Gatwick flight path, residents of the pretty Surrey village of Lingfield have long been used to the sound of aircraft. 70 years ago, during World War II, and things were much the same, with both German and Allied pilots flying overhead. It was in 1943 that villager John Riches was called up to the 617 Squadron, formed in great secrecy to bomb three major German dams. 617 Squadron, led by Gibson, trained with special bombs for their unique raid on the Mona and Eder Dam, supplying the Ruhr. RAF veteran and villager John Southgate was in awe of the dam buster heroes. 53 crew did not make it back from Operation Chastise, but he remembers the boost to morale. It came at a time when uh, things were a bit down, I think, and it was that uh, it was a sort of victory. It was they made a lot lot of it. 617 Squadron continued its bombing missions until the end of the war. 31 men were killed in action, including John Riches, who's now buried in Lingfield Churchyard. The Lancaster crashed minutes after takeoff, with many of the famous dambuster heroes on board. It wasn't many miles across the fields from where John Riches was born that the plane came down. Local farm workers tried to put out the flames, but all of the crew perished. It had been a terrible year for the village of Lingfield, with so many German pilots making sure they didn't take bombs with them back across the Channel. That particular year of the Dambusters that we're celebrating now, um, there had been two tremendous tragedies here, uh, where the school was bombed, and nearby in East Grinstead when the cinema was bombed, where um, 200, more than 200 people were killed. So um, they had got used to the tragedy um, all around them at the time. The planes don't stop over Lingfield, even when the minute silence is observed in remembrance. But that serves as a reminder of the bravery of the members of the 617 Squadron who lost their lives. Sarah Harris, BBC South East Today, Lingfield.